am so tired. What time tomorrow? Nine, nine thirty. Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Been feeling trapped down on the floor. I don't know what for. Feels like I'm gonna lose. Silence takes a hold. I can't let it go. Chain up, no one knows. But I won't let the stormy sea. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking. If you haven't already subscribed, just hit the subscribe button down below and come join my family on YouTube. Also hit the notification bell so that whenever I put out a video, you can be notified and you can go watch it. So guys, um, I haven't vlogged in a while. Yeah, I haven't I've been so busy, but I am taking a random trip. I'll tell you why. A little bit later but i'm taking a random trip and um yeah as usual i'm gonna take you along with me yeah i'll give you how this trip came about um a little bit later but right now i think my car hire is downstairs so i'm gonna go get there let me make sure that i remember to turn this this television off before i leave um passport check i have my passport i have money i have pcr test i have my visa so yeah i think i'm good to go so anyways guys um i will see you in a bit i'll probably talk to you when i get to the airport but yeah if you are interested in seeing where i'm going why i'm going there then just keep on watching to the end all right all right guys so now that i'm settled and in the car let me just tell the story as to why it's kind of like a sudden trip so i up to two weeks ago two yeah up to two weeks ago i didn't even have my um my resident permit or visa so i wasn't sure i was going to be able to go anywhere because of course i can't leave before i get it so i was still kind of planning faith well faith but i was planning to go to uganda and rwanda but then that kind of panned out because uh, I wasn't sure what was going on with this new um, variant and what countries they were going to ban and whatever the case might be. So I just decided not to take the chance and go to Rwanda and Uganda. But I still wanted to go somewhere, girls, guys. It has been such a rough term, you know, so I needed to relax, regroup and come again. So I decided to go to this country. If you want to find out what country it is then keep on watching to the end i hope i'll have a good time um a friend was supposed to come along with me but that didn't work out either so i'm going alone but that doesn't matter because i mean most of my trips i do solo anyway so but yeah i'm looking forward to going to a new country um it's not too far away either so it's not a long flight but let us see if you can figure out where i'm going drop your thoughts in the comment section below and let me know what country you think i'll be going to but if you really want to find out then keep on watching to the end of this vlog so i'll see you when i get to the airport <laughs> bathroom stop um back view of the outfit this is definitely no <laughs> um <stuff. laughs> the airport is not properly labeled it's confusing as hell big and empty as hell um i'm not empty in terms of people just like empty in terms of like how it's set up on whatever the case is but it is let me go back outside and see if i can find my way around and get checked in the check-in process is pretty simple and pretty easy um so i'm gonna go through the airport now and see if i can show you what this airport looks like um trying to make trying to make sure that i don't get anybody in so even though it's a muslim country and they don't celebrate christmas i guess because with all the experts they still have like um christmas decorations up and stuff so let me show you one of the um the displays that they have here hold a sec 
So this is one of their seasons uh, thing that they have. So anyway, this is so cute though. How are you? Very cute. Anyway, so let me see if I can show you what the um the airport looks like. Typical airport with your different um with your different uh, currency exchange and do the free places. So I'll see what I can show you. Of course, again, try not to get anybody in. Not about to get locked up <laughs> just to make a video. So. I'm trying to find something to eat. I'm going to be a bird from gate C8. Gucci. Just your regular um, beauty free stores. And this is one reason why you shouldn't come to the airport early. Super, super early because uh, you are so tempted to shop. Even things that you necessarily did not need. You find yourself stopping and shopping for no apparent reason. And I am about to make my first stop. Yep. I love the original um, the girl. So I'm cutting her. I wonder if I should get it there. Having a sale, but not on Good Girl. This cologne is never on sale. I kid you not. <sighs> should I? Should I? Should I? Should I? I made it to the check-in and we're now boarding. They actually started boarding on time. We're supposed to start at 610 and they actually started at 609. So yeah. Just waiting on my zone to be called to start the boarding process. Do my eyes look tired or maybe it's just because of the dark makeup that I have on? I know, but anyways, I am ready to go and find my seat and start sleeping. I am so tired, guys. But anyways, don't forget to write in the comment section what country you think I'm going to. Let's see if you're correct. <sighs> so we're going to be vacationing this December, this winter break. salad was very flavorful but too salty for my taste so I did not have all of that the biryani though on the other hand was very good it was so buttery and flavorful and not too um, not too too salty at all so I did enjoy that part of my meal
find something to watch. Um, I scroll through, there wasn't enough that I was interested in, to be honest, but then I found Escape Room, the Tournament of Champions, and decided to watch that, so... We finally landed. We got here a bit later than expected, but we're finally here. Going to arrival. I'm gonna go through immigration and customs, and then I'll be out. Let's see if you guys figure out where we're at as yet. I mean, there isn't anything here to give you a clue, but yeah. First clue though, it was 4 hours and 20 minutes from Dubai, so not very far. So think about countries that are, you know, not too far from Dubai. Oh. Second clue, they are into cricket. Yeah, it's a country that's really into cricket, so that's your second clue. Let's see if you figured it out as yet. But anyways, it's past one. We should have arrived at 12.45 a.m. But as I said, we started out late. An hour late from Dubai, so it's past one. I'm tired. And I'm pretty sure my driver is outside waiting on me. Has no way to get in touch with me as yet, so yeah. He's probably been here for a minute. But anyways, let me pay attention to where I'm going and I will see you guys in a minute. Okay, so I just got through immigration. That was very simple. Very, very easy to be precise. So now I am on my way to cabbage, to baggage claim. <sighs> Finally, one of these bags are coming out. My goodness, after more than 30 minutes, home bag. Excuse me. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yes, I was saying before you have to do like my um, health declaration form online and um, upload your PCR test and all of that. So I did all of that. So I have a code. So instead of having to sign up the form, I'm going to just show them the barcode. So that's what I'm going to scan now before I'm able to go out. So I'm finally out. I'm good. I'm finally out, and I met my driver, Roshan. He came highly recommended. Hi. So <laughs> I'm looking forward to spend the next 10, 11 days with him. So guys, I guess now I can officially say, welcome to Sri Lanka. <laughs> oh, so this is what outside of the airport looks like. <sighs> it's a small airport, like the ones we have in Jamaica. Nothing. Well, I think um, Sankt is a little bit bigger, but uh, yeah, it's a small airport, very clean, pretty organized. Uh, yeah. So anyways, after you show them the things that you already uploaded on the form, they're going to give you this little ticket here to say that you are um, completed your COVID-19 vaccination and uh, that you're negative, so you don't have to do the test. If you weren't, then you'd have to do a test and quarantine at your own expense. But since I'm not, I was free to go. So Rashawn just went to get in, um, the car to come back to pick me up. So I'm here. So I'm here. My bra is is showing. We're going to go to a hotel that's pretty close by. Um, and not one of the resorts that we chose, but one that's pretty close by since we got in so early this morning. Well, since I got in so early this morning, I'm excited to go see. I took out one airing, so <laughs> I just have one airing. But anyways, guys, if I don't show you the room, if I don't show you anything else for the night, it's goodbye. And I am looking forward to taking you around Sri Lanka with me. I wonder how many of you got that correct, though, or how many of you thought of that um, country. But anyways, guys, I will see you in the next vlog or maybe I might show you the room tonight before I mess it up. But whatever, I'll see you some other time.
Okay, so this is what the room looks like. There's a little seating area here and uh, a good size, queen size bed. Um, another seating area here, a workstation. The AC is on. View of the parking lot, nice floors outside. Okay, and this is what the bathroom looks like. I mean, it's pretty decent just for like um, a transit. It has all your basic amenities, which is all I need for the night. I was worried you blow up my reputation But I figured it's not on me Yeah, yeah, yeah The way you're making me shiver Your hands on my silver Keep pulling the trigger, alright There's very finger for people like that